Hey guys, Anthony here. Here is an article that uh, from the News Tribune here. U.S. and Chinese troops connect in first ever exchange at JBLM. Uh, it says 80 soldiers from the China's People Liberation Army are visiting Joint Base Lewis McCord. It's the first time Chinese troops have been invited to train in the continental U.S. Troops are all smiles, but mindful of revealing too much. Apparently, the, the theme of this training is uh, some kind of disaster preparedness, where on some type of fictitious island, Pacific Island, uh, there's an earthquake, and both Chinese and American uh, militaries need to respond. What concerns me is what's going on with the U.S. and China on a larger level uh, around the world. And so... I wanted to just note on this video that um, with the huge push for gun control in our country uh, and the push now even harder with Obama's last year in office, I think we're going to see, and I think we're seeing the beginnings of uh, boots on the ground uh, that, that may have been longer than, than we could imagine, but boots on the ground from other countries that are going to be used to help uh, disarm uh, the United States when uh, they're ready to do so. This may just be another way of getting, uh, you know, people here and getting it to look like it's a um, joint training exercise. But uh, what so? What say you guys? Um, that is my um, that is my uh, take on this. So I'd like to know your opinion. Uh, check out the article. There's a little short video here that shows them, you know, training, and then it shows both leaders at the end of the conference kind of saying thank you for coming and then shaking hands and, um, and the video ends. But uh, my view on this is that um, foreign troops will be used to try to disarm United States patriots in the coming months and years ahead. Thanks guys. Stay ready.